Time for the big boys Milan. We've got Pete Naylor against the big big man, Vincenzo Anzalone. But you know what they say, big boys, big problems. They also say the bigger they are, the harder they fall. Correct. And uh, Pete Naylor's looking for his first professional stoppage. Got out to a quick start here against the boss from Germany. Who's been stopped six times in his 19 losses. Naylor should be too quick, too talented. So let's just see if he can uh, he can find the right punches to get the boss out of there. Good start, Milan. Very good start, Pete. Oh, right, there we go. He can get him out of there. Lasted all of how long was that? Were you counting? Thirty seconds. Say thirty seconds. Yeah, Naylor was too quick, too sharp, too aggressive. Had way too much for the boss, and uh, just did what he should have done and got him out of there. So, first stoppage for Pete Naylor, stays unbeaten, seven and zero, and that'll be a big weight off his shoulders. Milan getting your first knockout. Yeah, and it just shows as well. Pete's a big, he's a big boy, but you know, his fitness is definitely there, as you can see. Both fighters there. Yeah, burst straight out of a trap, straight onto. Um, Mr. Anzalone, who had absolutely nothing. We've got to say it as it is. That was pretty terrible stuff from the boss. Uh, and But Pete Naylor took him apart. Really good for Pete Naylor. He's a good guy as well, isn't he, Milan? Yeah, very nice guy. He's, he's dedicated to the sport as well. You know, you go on Instagram, he's, he's out there doing those runs. And I tell you what, not, not a lot of people want to stay doing those runs, but goes a long way. Like I said, in the ring there, you see Pete's fitness compared to... Yeah. You know, the boss's fitness. So. Yeah, Pete, Pete was a big boy when he first started boxing, wasn't he? And he's trimmed down, lost about 40 or 50 pounds. Been really dedicated. And uh, it's all going the right way for Pete. And I would love to go over to Bradford to watch Pete in front of his crowd because he brings a lot of people over to he Manchester. Does. So he, he really does. Be a popular guy if he went over to Bradford, wouldn't it? Uh, Pat Barrett, a man who knows a thing or two about knocking people out, he'll be pleased that Pete Naylor's got his first stoppage. There we go, let's get the official time. Uh, the boss isn't very happy. Yeah, he, he looks disappointed, but you know, how else are you going to feel when you get in the ring? And it ends that fast. Yeah, there we go. Uh, Forty one seconds. Just way too much for him, and, and the boss isn't happy, but maybe he should be happy it didn't go any longer because he escaped getting really badly hurt there, didn't he? It was over and done before he could get take a real beating. So um, there we go, another win for Pete Naylor.